it's sad to say this, but social media is becoming the rise of the nut jobs. You know, social media is a gift and a curse. You have some people right now who are, they are suffering. They, they're probably in a, they're suffering from deep mental illness and deep problems. They just get on social media and vent. Don't you know, and that's not a problem, okay? You have some people who they have deep, dark thoughts. You know, some thoughts that probably wouldn't be, that are fringe to some. That's why you have, that's why you have a lot of content that's like you have this that you may look at as being out there like you've never seen people have never had witchcraft being just taught in depth and how to do this on you know online how to conjure demons literal de you know it's actually stuff like that on there's that's out online you have a bunch of occult stuff online people don't even understand that it's a cult you have a lot of People who will do it like jackass and two point man, jackass to the tenth power is all over the internet, TikToks and now I mean you can't really do that on TikTok for the most part, but you still and you have but you still have people talking about things and that are just pretty. You can say whatever you want, but these things are just pretty much out there. It's a it's a multiple way. It's a multitude of ways that you can incite um that you can incite chaos that you can incite disingenuous you can input disingenuous information out into the atmosphere and again not everybody should be given a platform i'm just sorry they shouldn't that's that's how i feel about it you can you know not everybody should be given a platform to speak because some people they're not even they don't have it all together. And YouTube seems to, YouTube and social media period seems to look at that and that, well, they don't evaluate like, is this person, like, I know it's not their job to do that, but you have, they do to pick and choose information that goes out. If you like, and it just, the thing is, it's not even YouTube's fault. It's the people. People love to see this type of stuff. People, that's why you get more and more unhinged people come on social media. Like, look at people like Alex Jones. They ended up finally getting him off the internet. And I'm not saying Alex Jones, like, was just totally, was was as bad. If you look at people on the internet now, you got Alex Jones 2.0s. You got Alex Jones to the 10th power. Alex Jones or Donald Trump, they weren't the worst, like, when it comes to, to at least following etiquette you know now don't get me wrong donald trump donald trump had his had his issues as well let me just say this like people like alex jones and donald trump those are people see them as being unhinged and they want to get them off the internet but now you have you have people doing the same thing or worse and that's what people gravitate to I want like that. people was gravi people gravitated to alex jones people gravitated to donald trump People like to, their people love to see people become unhinged. People are right now are on the internet talking about Jaguar Wright and, and, and her uh, marriage and her whole, and her husband. People shouldn't even know about that. We shouldn't be knowing about that. We shouldn't be seeing people go, you go live and getting arrested. And, you know, you have people like, you have people getting on the internet, inciting, they want to talk about, <laughs> inciting things against other people they they just totally don't get how they totally don't get how they look they just get on live and get to talking people they don't care about their well-being other people well-being they don't care about their family's well-being they just talking just you know and it's not a problem again you have people have freedom of speech i'm not trying but when you start to uh, people, it's the things that people pay attention to. It's really the people. Like I said, they love to see people become the more unhinged they become, the more uh, nutty that the more unorthodox they seem, 
that's what people want to see. That's what entertains them. You know, it's a show to them. But they don't really care about those people or the message that they put in out. This is what and this is what's going to you're going to start seeing more people start doing it. So but the whole platform it's up to these platforms. You're going to start having to police a lot more people. You policing the wrong people. You know, you don't police people with truth, giving delivering truth. And things like that, just because you don't like their message, you know, when you got people who just, and it's the thing, you have LGBT people coming on here, they just, they totally unhinged, not all of them, I'm saying some of these people who come on here and, and talk about, I want to teach your children, I want to do this, and, and you know, just put themselves out there like that, they don't get banned, they don't get these platforms taken, but people are willing to just put themselves out there like that. And they get a lot of people to gravitate to them. Even people who don't, who, like I said, you got to know who laughing with you and who laughing at you. You have even people who don't have their best interests at heart, but they still over there paying attention to it. You know, it's it's pretty spooky this day and age. And I'll take that turn from my, from my partner in rent, man, because, you know, shout a salute to that brother, man. But it's spooky these days. And that's real talk. Like the unhinged are becoming or gaining power. They gaining and it's through the viewership. You remember the the, the um it's I'm serious. It's, you can, like look at what was happening in Rome. America is in a dangerous spot. And they need to really check themselves before they wreck themselves. And it's due to a lot of this media, big companies. This media is a lot of money in this. And because the people, it's like in times of Rome, because the people of the Colosseums are choosing certain people to be, you know, they they putting money behind them and view it. They choosing them through their viewership, through their, and I get it. Sometimes you just want to know what's going on. You know, it's, it's a lot of people just want to be nosy. I get it. Even I fall victim to that sometimes. But curiosity killed a cat and you know I, a lot of times if it ain't got nothing to do with me i'm like i'm just gonna just totally i'm telling you i'm totally blocking out a lot of this stuff that's why you don't see me doing many videos you know because i'm totally blocking out i don't want to do my con i actually make content i don't want to do content talking about other people all the time man that's not what i ever did my platform for this platform is to get the truth out for the lord that's it you know, and I use I can use these real world scenarios, for example, I, I use these, you know, because that's what, you know, these things are going on. And sometimes you again, you're human. I understand you're going to call out BS when you see it. But if it's not to edify, correct, you know, another brother or something like that or sister, it shouldn't you know, you shouldn't even do it. You shouldn't even be, you know, because, again, you got to, these videos don't go away. That's how cases are built. A lot of people are going to go away, you know, and when things are said and done, a lot of people going to get, you know, it's just going to be, they're going to lose everything that they built because a lot of stuff that they said can be, you know, it's going to, people are going to eventually pull that up. Uh, people are going to, you know, eventually once they, when, once they just slip up or, or people get the powers that be get tired of them or they, you know, or, or somebody have to discard them as the scapegoat. They're going to build a case using all that stuff that they say. Like, you know, people, like I said, you can be a psychologist, psychiatrist need to look at some of this stuff because people are really on here not acting like normal human beings, not, you know, not showing, just causing chaos and confusion. That's all I can say, for lack of a better term. They're just getting on there venting, talking, and the more and more, the more people pay attention, the worse and worse they get, the more and more over the top they'll get, the more and more they'll try to give you to get that same feeling, you know, and people know that they can manipulate people like that. 
And for you to do that, you know, it says something about you. Like, that says something about society itself. Again. But, hey, it is what it is, man. You know, this is your man, Nico B. Black Effect. I'm gone.